it. Oh, come on. Not early. We're going to get demonetized. Sorry. Hello and welcome to another episode of the Ace Podcast. What? Break show. Getting ahead of myself. We're not even <laughs> recording the podcast this week. I was thinking yeah, about it. That's when true. I was driving over here and yeah. I'm bummed because I was mm-hmm. thinking about all the stuff that I can't talk about. Yeah, there's a lot. There's yeah. a lot. Yeah. Uh, but that's not what this is. Mm-hmm. This is the break show. Yep. My name is Jeff Ramsey. His name is Jason Tatum. He's the best. My wife, Emily Hatfield. Hi. Uh, Eric Bedore, a producer extraordinaire. Uh, I know the dog's name. He. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, he, he says he knows the dog's name, but he's not told me the dog's yeah. name yet. Oh, yeah, sure. wait. So you. I can say it right now. No, don't no. say it here. Don't no. say it here. Interesting. I, oh, okay. I, confer- I confirmed Gracie it confirmed. with my wife and Gracie. Oh, okay. He knows the dog's name then. There hey, you go. hang on. Camera on me. Hey, guys, if you're watching this, don't forget to become a first member. Shane, are you getting this? Don't forget to become a first member. Your patronage helps us so much. And what I'm asking you is to go to fuckfacepod.com and become a first member. Fuckfacepod.com slash sign up. To become a first member. Thank you so much. You can continue the show now. You know what you should do? What was that? That what? was really sincere. That was really nice. That was really sweet. I he really had a that. smile. I, he was no, like, it for was pennies like, on the dollar, you too could support Fuckface. It's very Sally Struthers. Yeah. Yeah. Or, I'm sorry, that's a, maybe a dated reference. That's a very, I, no one who's watching this gets that. Very uh, Sarah McLaughlin. Oh, nice. There you go. You know what you should do is that once, obviously once, like, Andrew, Andrew and Gavin and Nick are the only ones that don't know the name. That's right? true. Yeah. So once they figure it out or whatever, mm-hmm. before you tell the audience, you should tell your first members first. Oh, a first perk is knowing the dog's name. A first, first. Monetize no, the no, dog. No, no, I'm not. Monetize the dog. No. Monetize the dog. We're not monetizing the dog. We're not selling information. I uh-huh. sell my dog to Disney. If yeah, that, and we'll sell him to you. And we'll sell him to you, first members. Yes. Thank you so much for being a first member, and you can support the show by becoming a first member, supporting us directly. Nope. You can go and clip, the, you Gracie, you can go ahead and clip that out. I think, I think it's the Falcon. I th- you know what? I think that when they clip it, it needs to be like, ding. <laughs> I think the shoulder Falcon is just in my ear. He's yeah. saying, he's, he's saying, tell them about becoming a first Dude. member. You know what it is? What? Is that you don't have to have your hard exterior shell because you're protected by a Falcon. I am. It's so true. You can be I yourself. can relax. Yes. You know what's relax. pretty cool about that Falcon while we're mentioning it? Uh-huh. All this is all being filmed. Yeah. And that's fine. And that's fine. Because that is a 100% filmable Falcon. <laughs> I was talking to someone earlier, and no one's going to get that until the episode comes out next week. <laughs> the, problem, <laughs> the problem with the face universe <laughs> is that we record this stuff in such a weird way that we're making inside jokes that you guys aren't going to get for a while. It's, it's very exciting. Yeah. I'm frankly very excited about it. It would be wild to go yep. back and watch it canonically, yep. all the content but we have. Friday, the 16th, if you're watching this live, or I guess the VOD of this, because it comes out Thursday, Falcon goes on sale, hat goes on sale, bumper sticker goes on sale, shirt goes on sale, get protected by Falcons. The bumper sticker says, and it's in the video that we're, we're releasing tomorrow or whatever, is this car is protected by Falcons and has the Falcon on it. That's awesome. That's it that is awesome. It's so cool. Also, but check this out. Watch this. Camera on me. Watch this. Yeah, it's his hat oh, comes off. Snakey. Well, now he can attack. Now he can see. Now he's in attack oh. mode. Go! Now he's in. Now he's in. Uh, now he's in Shmi mode. Yeah. It's like, uh, <laughs> <laughs> what if you named the dog Shmi? That, <laughs> that would have been, been crazy. Funny. That been funny. Uh, I love that little falcon, though. Oh, I gotta great. say, we filmed a commercial in it earlier today. Yeah. I think it might be the funniest thing we've done in a little bit. I am. I'm very happy. I'm very, very happy about it. We'll we'll release it. If you're watching this live, we'll release it tomorrow. But. We should put it on the baby's uh, little. A harness so that <gasps> when he's walking, and then he's, he's got protected. a little protected. Oh, that's a good idea. Mm-hmm. That's a good idea. And then he can ride the puppy. Yeah. Oh, that's fun. Hey, what are we getting into today? Let's uh, let's get into some shit. Uh, first thing we're gonna do is obviously we're gonna open up a pack from the pack sack. Yeah. We're gonna show the graded cards from last week. Yeah. We're gonna do the mail. Uh, and then we'll just open up cards. But let me show you what we have, what we're working with. What's our big deal today? coming in? And we can pick the big deal. Oh, okay. Ooh, deal or no deal? Couple things that's I fine. definitely want to open. No deal. NBA <laughs> Prism just came out. Uh. And uh, so we got a couple cool. of a, cu- cool, got a couple cool, cool. Of blasters of that. Yep. Cool hand. Excited Luka. about that. Mm-hmm. Got a uh, got a Victor Wembanyama silver, silver prism <gasps> over the weekend. I yeah, should have yeah. brought it in to show it. It's the card. Dang. I'll bring it next week. Um, so we can we'll definitely fuck with those. You could have. I was at your house. You could have just showed me. I could have showed you. Then you wouldn't have cared then either. We were in Super Bowl mode. We were. That's right. We were in football mode. I was, that was eating, basketball. I was eating jalapeno poppers like crazy. Dude, I was eating so much of that goddamn pizza bread. It was <laughs> Dude, the pizza bread was so good. Nick's buffalo chicken dip. Oh, I liked buffaloes. 
<laughs> I was jealous about that. Yeah. Everybody, yeah. everybody loved it. I liked my onion dip. Oh, the onion dip was really good with homemade bell peppers. Homemade caramelized woo, 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 onion dip. Woo. Can I? I also don't like her homemade onion dip because it's got. What was in that? Cottage Carp cheese? No, it has a uh, sour, sour cream. It's like a look at Gracie. It's a cottage cheese. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, it's sour. It's like a, it's normal. It's sour cream. It's and normal. Cream. She, it's normal. It's I'm gonna cottage. I'm gonna say this. I hope this uh -huh. isn't too rough for this program. But watching her caramelize those onions yesterday, it was almost erotic. <laughs> She was doing such a job, and those onions looked so goddamn well, you can, good. Well, if you like this talk and more, check out Clutch My Pearls. Yes! I was like, <laughs> I was like, fucking, all right. I guess I'm into onions. He was all now. horned up, and, yeah. uh, you know. Do you know about nodding yet? Uh, no. Wait, oh, you can tune do? in tomorrow uh, and learn, have Eric's wife explain what nodding is on Clutch My Pearls. Clutch My Pearls pod everywhere on the on. Uh, it's a hill in England. Not it. Oh. Open something. Yeah. That Open some cards. I'm, I'm really happy with that. Do I got, a I got, a, I got an approval from Gracie on that. <laughs> Boo! Right, let, let Boo! Me show you, let me show you what we're working with. Uh, we got some more NBA uh, prism that Gracie got for me. We got this. It must have been free. It's an element. It is. Thing. Don't yeah. know what the fuck that is. Uh, then we got, I looked up, so one of the big websites, Cardboard Connection, has like the hottest cards. Yeah. Hot, hottest boxes being sold. Okay. And the hottest thing Ooh. being sold, the most sold right now, is this Topps Heritage oh, Baseball cool. High Number 2023. Uh -huh. So I had her buy two boxes of this, so uh -huh. maybe we'll open one of these. That's fun. And then this I'm kind of interested in. Uh, I was going to let you guys make the decision between this and the next thing. Mm. This is a 2024 NES Nintendo cartridge. What? Uh, it's like a graded, oh, I think it's graded, it may not be graded, but it's like a collectible, you don't know what you get in cartridge blind box. Because these are collectible now, too. I thought it'd be fun to fuck with some, some oh, that's, other forms. I, I like that a lot. This is dangerous for you, that's, I know. Uh, that's very funny. I like that a lot. So that we got this. I want that. Okay. Then or okay. I also, I, I picked up uh -huh. another basketball. I wanted to open up another big-ass basketball. Yeah. So I picked this Emerald Collection. I had Gracie buy it. Yeah. And this is it. And then I realized, after I had her buy it, uh, I asked her to buy the wrong thing. I didn't ask her to buy a basketball. I asked her to buy a basketball card. So this is just one card. In what? So That's can... only one card? Yeah, but it's going to be good. Oh, <laughs> oh I, want, I'm, I want to open it up. I fucked up. I fucked up. So either we open up, I think we open up the and we're not, we're not doing this next week because it's a holiday, right? Yes, it is, yeah. So we either do this very expensive card, <laughs> I think. Oh, my I God. Think. I mean, I think it is because it's not a, I don't see a basketball. No, I don't, right? well, maybe it's, I mean, we just have to inflate so it. So I think I fucked it. up. Yeah. And then, uh, or we can open this uh, NES cartridge. We can't do both. Here's, here's, the whole, here's what the we'll do. Right here. Here's what we'll do. We're going to have our own say. If you're in the chat, let us know right now which one it'll be, and we'll make a decision towards the end of the show okay. about we're going to open one of these. Okay. So the chat can let us know what they think. And I think that's we'll, a great idea. So it's it's either a single basketball card or the NES cartridge. And boy, I wonder what these uh, nerds online are going to want to, <laughs> us to open. My people. Oh, yeah. both. We're definitely not doing both. No. Uh, you have to pick one. Sorry. Uh, okay. What do you? What'd you let, say? Let's. I didn't say anything. You just burped. No, you didn't. Yeah, you. Yeah. I didn't burp, but I did. <laughs> um, my birthday was this weekend, and Andrew sent me Fresca. <gasps> oh, that's Andrew fun. Did, and that's sent, so nice. He sent treats for the puppy too. Yeah, he sent dog toys, Fresca, because I love it, mm -hmm. and uh, some flowers, because he's so sweet. He's he sweet is boy. super sweetheart. Um, Seems I, to be real. <laughs> I'm hoping that the cartridge is Duck Hunt. And then I'm gonna say that this is a Celtic because it's green. Oh, that'd be oh really that's nice. fine. That'd be really nice. Uh, let's do the let's do the last last week's values, right? Okay. Uh, there really wasn't a lot of shit in there that nah. was interesting. No. But, there, but this. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, autograph card we pulled. So I did some research on it. Got conflicting answers what on that? what this is. What does that mean? This is a going yard autograph orange parallel of Jordan yeah. Alvarez. It was the big pull last week. So there are two websites that list card checklists when they come out. Yeah. Beckett and Cardboard Connection. Beckett says this is uh, numbered to 50. Cardboard Connection says this is numbered to 5. Whoa. It's going to be a wild difference in wow. value depending on which is which. I'm not going to know the truth until I send it off and get it back. When do oh. you do that? I didn't, I, I didn't have time to do it. Last week, so I'll do it today. Yeah. I just, just got to scratch off this thing. Wow. Was that uh, the thing you got? Uh, you didn't. You got that on this or on? Yeah. At home? It was like you got the, something it was else pole. at home. Oh, the webbing out that we're going to send off. Yeah. Webinar. We'll send that off too. I'm never going to. But remember. I just need to scratch this off and enter it into the website today. It's called uh, Wemby. Wemby. I can there do you that. Go. That's easy. But so it's either it's just either worth about three hundred dollars or seventy five. I just don't know yet. Dude, we got to get so, the eBay going already. I know, right? I'll work on it. But that's that's last week's bullshit. Okay. So we'll, I'll I'll be back with more information on that when it finally comes in. Okay. Uh, let's rip open something from the pack sack. Exactly. As you know, or if you don't know, 
Uh, every week, we uh, we reach our little grubby hands into the pack sack, and Get we pull out a pack. Get like elbow deep, man. What are you doing? Oh, I got Big Desert deep. Storm cards. So he wow. Just yeah, that. he loves it. I got just, in there. This guy just like loves Kuwait. <laughs> he misses. I spent it. almost a year of my life. <laughs> I've been there three times. We talked about it on an animal recording today. Jeff went to college for a little while, stuff I didn't know about. So. Oh, you didn't, you didn't know I went to the University of South Carolina for a little bit. Yeah. Uh, go Gamecocks. Is that you? Yeah. Daddy's home. Daddy's no, home. no way, baby. Uh, That's me. Safe <laughs> at home. Oh. <laughs> uh, we united. So are these just all? These like, are all just the one guy coming home. Yeah. Uh, here's some target markings, whatever that means. I guess that's how many bullets for each of those things. Wow. Uh, Francois Mitterrand. And then we have, of course, the Iraqi Surrender. Was that you? Uh, okay. Did you do that? <laughs> I did it. <laughs> that's Iraqi's that Surrender C. Here's Iraqi's <laughs> Surrender A. Oh, uh, wow. If we get B, we get the whole set. Ooh, we get the big dog. We get the big swinging dick. General Colin Powell himself. Oh, man. Dang, the man. big dog. And then, uh, oh, check it out. There's a little medal, medal of honor. Yeah. Did you get one of those? I did not. Oh. No, no, I didn't do anything in my time in the military that warranted a medal. I got a couple of RCOMs. Those are nice. That's, like, like, that's awesome. I don't know what that is. some AAMs. What's an RCOM? Army Commendation Medal. Oh. Army Achievement Medal. I got a bunch of those. Got some Foreign Service Great. stuff. I mean, you, went, you went to school until they had to kick you out of school to go to Kuwait. <laughs> that's true. That's true. I did have to leave my fucking school early. Uh, we also got something a little bit special this week. We'll do okay. a mail. Let's do it. Yesterday, I was hand delivered a package by Bernie Bat Dog. Oh, himself. that's Bernie. Break show, G Bone, and, and People's, People's Princess. Princess. Hey. Wow. He also he also drew for uh, Emily's birthday a he great drew picture, me a picture of uh, you. Yeah. You to, there you go. Oh, you can see it in Jeff shot. That's so cool. Right that's for, great. Em, for some reason, for he was like, yeah, it's Emily's birthday, so I thought I'd drop it. Yeah, for you. yeah, it's good. Appreciate so what do we got from the Let's bat see dog? What we got from Man, he dog. was taking care of your dog last I night. I knew it. He put chains he's, in it. He's Why? A, I don't know. Because <laughs> he's his uncle. He also gave him. He tried to give him beer last night. Oh yeah. He tried to give the baby just beer. a little bit, and, and it was just night. a Bud Light. <laughs> it's hardly even beer. Uh, here we go. Dear G Bone, he's got such good handwriting. Really? He's an artist. Uh, he he really oh, is. Yeah. Dear G Bone, the People's Princess, and whoever showed up this week, uh, probably not Come yet. on, man. What That's the true. fuck? I present to you three packs of cards oh. from when I was a baby kiddo. They're not too crusty and have only been underwater once or twice. <laughs> I think you'll enjoy opening them on your program. The Batman bubblegum is still good to feel free to share with the rest of the crew. Thanks, bud. Oh, yeah. I don't want the gum to go to waste, so I've included return postage. <laughs> <laughs> P.S. Listen to Clutch My Pearls podcast. Hey. Sorry, Aaron. Hey. See you in the mud, Bernie right. Bat Dog. Well, that's oh. going up on yeah. right there. That's good. And there's the return postage. Oh, my God. And let's see what he got us. We got Batman, Batman, and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh, nice. Really? All right. Cool. Let's do it. We got to eat that gum, too. Yeah. No. Uh, Vanessa told me that he woke up this morning pissed uh, that they that we didn't eat enough of that queso last night. I, I didn't forgot about queso. Dude, I forgot the queso was there. <laughs> I wish I would have eaten the queso. What are you doing, Jeff? I ate the gum. You he idiot. It was still good. It, is, it was. I ate it. Ugh, Bernie. fucking hell. Burn dog. I, pe yeah, people were upset about the food that didn't didn't get eaten last night, but I mean, I, that's, I, how, that's how parties work. I, I would have so just much. eaten more. Yeah I, yeah, I went crazy on Nick Stip. It was bad. First card I got from we got from Bernie Bad Dog. There's the Joker hey. himself. I hate these movies. Uh, what? You didn't yeah. like the Tim Burton Batman? They're so gross to look at. Oh, I love it. Hate it. Speaking of, it's so that's ugly. His vision. It is just so ugly. Do you prefer the Robert Pattinson like moody one? It's not the moodiness that I like. It's just that like this era of filmmaking is like vile to me. It's you, so gross. Do you remember when he was like, "Hey, Batman, do you ever dangle with the devil in uh, the pale moonlight?" He didn't say he's a dance. No, he said dance. He's um, dance um it, it's just like. Well, this is a comic, and we're going to make it in real life. It's like, oh, is there creative liberty? No, we make it in real life. I oh, hate it. Dude, here's something for us. Knox chats with Alfred, and who is Knox? But Robert Wall. We got his autograph. Oh, Didn't we? yeah, Big Bob Wall. Yeah, we Where'd got his get... autograph. Uh, it might be in here. What was he, from Batman? Or uh, was it, was, from? it was, oh, I don't have it with me. It's uh, probably in the office, but it was from... It was from uh, something else he did. Yeah, I, I don't remember. We got it like two it weeks ago. Yeah. That hat's so good. It even has a Isn't that awesome? logo in yeah. the back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What Tim Burton wants, Tim Burton gets. Creative yeah. liberty. Gross. Danger in the streets. That's when before they get killed. It's like this. You know what they say, danger in the streets, boring in the sheets. Yeah. Uh, it's like this and Dick <laughs> Tracy and like those. It's Roger just Rabbit. Like, yeah. Yeah. Please. <laughs> uh, Tim Burton filmmaker. <laughs> Just actually, in case you didn't know. Thanks, man. Who, who for real killed Batman's parents? 
No, it was know. just. It was just. They uh, still never know. Yeah, it's no, it's, it's just. It's just a guy. He'll never it's know. Like a thug. I mean, They're, they changed the story. They times, tried to wreck on it to be like, it's the Joker. It's but really it, it's the Joker. really. It's, you're not it's supposed to. Just a guy. It's okay, just yeah. like it was just a random criminal. Yes. That's why he's obsessed. Because with that's the way crime happens. Because if he not always if he knew who killed his parents, he could go avenge their death. Yeah. He could go be a normal person and get over it, but he can't because he doesn't know. A faceless person killed them, so he has to eradicate all crime. He was but a boy when it happened, Emily. He was. Yeah, and in a dark alley. Yeah. Mm -hmm. With a rose. In fact, it was Crime Alley. <gasps> ah, they should rename that. They, should, they shouldn't call it, they should call it Cool Alley or something, yeah, you know what I mean? Alley. Yeah. Ooh, these are TMNT1 photo, movie oh. photos. I don't know that we've opened these yet. Well, we've opened some, but I don't know if these. Uh, oh, oh, fuck. Look Stickers. at that. We got a Donatello sticker. Oh, that's cool. Is that's he the worst Ninja Turtle? Cool. Who's the worst Ninja Turtle? You're too old for Ninja Turtles. I only like I'm not babies. too old for them. No? I, when I was a kid, Ninja Turtles were big because they were happening. Like, the Eastman Laird comics were coming out, like, in the mid-'80s when I was a kid. Yeah. And so they were cool. Uh -huh. Like, I remember we used to get these Ninja, these books. Uh, my friend had one that just had... Uh, drawings of all the Ninja Turtles doing combat poses. And it was just like, uh, almost like a tutorial on martial arts. <laughs> and it was like very serious early on. It was, it was really cool. Yeah. It was all, gritty. They all were like the, like the one color. They weren't different yeah. colors. Armed and anxious. Uh, but to answer your question, yeah. uh, probably Donatello. Yeah. Uh, Raphael to the rescue. He's wearing that. Uh... Yeah, no one will ever suspect that he's a giant turtle. He's either a giant <laughs> turtle or a Sam Spade style guy <laughs> getting to the bottom of the case. Pursued by the enemy. Was the enemy a train? The enemy is very small. Casey, Mr. Fix It. Yep. Oh, yeah. Speaking of Casey, there you go. Tough rocks, Raphael. Oh, my God. The battle rages on. Just hanging. That's what we're doing. Uh -huh. Yeah. April gets carried away. April. And oh, then carried away. Raphael revives from the bathtub, it looks like. Yeah. yeah. And then next we have Batman Returns. It was the number one hit movie. It, it's true. It was. Who do you feel is the ultimate Batman? Like, like the, of the, if you had to choose oh, the actors. Dude. Val Kilmer, Check. George Clooney. Oh, who do I pick? My Batman, Bruce Wayne. <laughs> what do you call? Like, what do you, go what the do you mean? The Playboy billionaire? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, ooh, look at this. Batman Returns. Speaking of Batman, there we have, it looks like a uh, Jacob's gravestone. Sultan of the Sewers. <laughs> That's like a, I like Oswald Cobb. It's like, look at it. It's gross. Yeah, it's very Tim Burton. A penguin <laughs> scorn. I don't like any of Tim Burton stuff. And he was just troops. the guy for this. Ugh. Invading Gotham. So you don't like any Tim Burton stuff? No, I don't think so. You like Pee Wee's Big Adventure? I had a whole conversation about this the other day. I'm not a huge Pee Wee's Playhouse guy. I like the movies, like the movies fun. Um, but man, when I look at it for too long, it's just like, ah, oh, get this away from me. I fucking love that. Movie. I get what you're saying about Tim Burton. And I'm not just, as into Tim Burton as a lot not, of other people. It's Frankie Weenie fucking Edward Scissorhands shit. I can't. <laughs> Beetlejuice Frank ass. And uh. <laughs> uh, in the clown's clutches, aren't we all? <laughs> uh, birth of the Catwoman. Meow. That, she seems like she was born uh, fully. Adult human being. Strange. I hate to see that birth canal. The fuck is happening? Birth go to the, of Catwoman. Go woman. to the next car. Birth of Catwoman. Go woman. to the next car. Meow. Okay. Meow. <laughs> Shrek's final stand. Shrek! Oh. Different Shrek. Not Don't the get... one I'm used to. Shrek looks like a... Uh, Dude, get out of his swamp. Shrek looks like that little dork from the <laughs> Harry Potter. What's his name? Is it, is, Harry Potter? Is Christopher yeah, Wallace? no, the blonde one, Malfoy. Yeah. That's Christopher Walken, though, right? Is that? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is. Like, his Walken. commercial yesterday on. It was cute. Was it? What was the one commercial that got us all silent? Was it the one where everyone was like sucking feet. on toes or it whatever? It wasn't the feet. Oh. We were only screaming feet. But there was some. That's there was one. one commercial that made us all silent. Um, what was that? I don't know. There was the there was, was the sweet. Robert Kennedy one where we just kept that, going unbelievable. That one I think got us silent though. Was, I was going, is this fucking? Yeah, we could not believe that it was. I think it was that like, that did, is it? Is it? Did they just call it the eyes? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Why are the <laughs> eyes? What the fuck are we doing? <laughs> it was no, really that's crazy. what it was. It was the Kennedy that's one. So By the way, he has already issued an apology today for that. Has he really? Really? Of well, course. he was a very careful. He said, I'm, I apologize if that commercial offended you. Yeah, 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 yeah. I apologize yeah. that I used my campaign funds on Yeah, I that. apologize yeah. that I used my dad's old commercial and or my grandfather's yeah. commercial and tuck it in. Or uncle, I guess. Uh, okay, what's next? Uh, that was from Thank Bad you, Dog. Thank Bad you, Bernie. Dog. Bad Dog. Uh, you're the best. Let's <laughs> fuck this. I don't up. know what this is. It also you there's nothing on the back that's readable, so. Yeah, what is this is the uh, 
shit we had laying around the office that we didn't know how to well, get rid of. Gracie the, looked at it and went, oh, no, we're going to let him open this. Oh, this yeah, is great. Cards. If, if they're no good, Fisher's going to love these. Which Fisher, fucking... Fisher, this one's Ooh. for you, buddy. We got two of the... All right, well, this is going to go in the past. Yeah. Like, right away. Yeah. Is this for the new movie? Or is this the old one? New, new Elemental new is a movie? new. Oh, what's You're, the other one that's emotions? Out? We were talking about this yesterday. Yeah. Inside Out, Inside Out 2, and Elemental are too fucking confusing. Yeah. Are I think th it's just too similar with, like, here's Colors. the color of this guy, yeah. and here's the color of this guy. And they, is Elemental, I assume, do they represent, like, the elements on the periodic table? How did you say that? Elemental. <laughs> I think it's, like, fire, wind, water. Heart. Those elements. Go planet. Heart. Yeah. What the fuck is oh, this? Oh, it's like a film what set. are these? It's a fucking What's film happening? Set. It's a film set. Oh, <laughs> what? Hey, wow. These oh. movies aren't on film. Do you need this on white? <laughs> this <what> this? <laughs> it's yeah. an animated yeah. movie. What's wow. happening? All right. Well, let's... we have a bunch of those? I don't want those. <laughs> we got, uh, let's open up one more and we'll save the others. Let's see what this one is. I'm going to guess this one's the same fucking thing, but with that, this character. The blue character. Why is it? Oh, he's so cute, though. He's Why probably is a water guy. Here's the deal. It was given away Ooh. for free, so uh, that's probably the value it has. Yeah, these... All right. Again, yeah. it's on film. This movie isn't on film. It's not like it was shot. <laughs> it's animated. It's an animation cell. Again, not how this is made. Cool. Not how this is made, but I like it. That's weird. It's going right there with Medal of Honor as my card of the day so far. Ooh. Uh, all right, let's open up a little bit of basketball. Let's get into some. Let's do it. it. Oh. Can you get me a treat? We're supposed to open up. I did, and we're supposed to open up mail. I'm sorry. One thing at a time. All right, this is from <laughs> Cole. I don't know. One thing at a time, Emily. I'm trying to go in the order I presented it. And Cole didn't send us a letter or a note or anything. But they did send a Holy shit. box of unopened 792 cards, Major League Baseball 1991 complete set. Now, here's what this is going to have in it. Whoa. It's going to have a, a Don Zim. <gasps> Should we pop it open oh. and just look at it? See if we can find we it. We haven't had a Zim in so long. We haven't opened up a... I don't know if we've ever opened up a... Oh, this is... Wow, that's... Uh... In opened, I think. Yeah. All right, let's see. Careful. <gasps> oh. Is it just the cards? Yeah, it's just, I mean, I don't even think there's anything extra in it. It's there's just a... one through 792. It's the whole thing? Yeah, it's you the whole do, like... set. So wherever Don Zimmer is in here, Don Zimmer, what number is Don here, Zimmer? Here, do this and then I'll tell you when to stop. Faster. Faster! Stop. Faster. <laughs> I got nails. I can help you. Oh, yeah, nails. Here, let me get in on this. Yeah, yeah. This is all <laughs> coming together. There you go. Now flip through those. Bo Jackson. Hey! That's who you pulled, Bo Jackson. Hell yeah. Pretty cool. 600, We could do an instant These winning. are not in order. Uh, Carlton Fisk. That's awesome. This is one of the good uh, Zimmer cards, too. So we'll find that. Thank you so much, Colin. That is awesome, yeah. man. And uh, we really appreciate that. And we're really excited we to like fuck around with these. Good. What do you say? One. I'm talking to the bird. Oh, okay. We like that. That was pretty good. Uh, I don't blame you either. All right. We'll put those there right here. And then somebody else sent in. Uh-huh. This is from... Send you a thank you note. You can learn more about your gift. Okay, that's okay. not. <laughs> well, to, to the person that sent us this. Amazon. Amazon. Let's see if it has. Yeah, it's not going to have any. I don't know who you are, but I'm so thankful that you sent this box of. Who are you? Major who League Soccer. Uh, Tops Major League Soccer. Cards, 66 cards total. Let's see what's up. I don't think we've opened these yet before. My pick of the day is the yep. Sultan of the Sewers. You. Because it reminds me of the Clutch My Pearls episode where Jesus they went to Christ. Dark Olympus. It was the Hades, and I could only compare him to Oswald Cobblepot because that's what I imagined. The you're not Hades. good at. No. Subtle. You're like you're like so bad at picking who a person is. Yeah. <laughs> Like it's like it's it's exceptional. It truly yeah. is like I'm learning a lot about my wife through this podcast. Yeah. Like it's she's only attracted to Jesse. Jesse Eisenberg. No, I'm not. If I, if I had to think of a nerdy witch boy to cast <laughs> in a part, that was who right, I right, right. But you can I'm make him shy. No, well, no. Wait, who did? Uh, Barbara came and said Michael Sarah would have been better. Michael Sarah. Uh, 
They're the same. Was to marginally better. Is he better? I don't, they are the same person. No. I don't know. The but when I had to, when I had to cast like a super hot mobster dude, yeah. Tom Hardy. Love it. It took yeah. her a while to get there. Yeah, yeah no because kidding. all I could do is look at the photo of you in your office and just, I couldn't think of anybody else. Yeah, speaking of super hot dudes like Jeff, Gaston <laughs> Brugman. Yeah, Brugman. He, he's, uh, he plays for Herbalife Nutrition. He plays for the uh, LA Galaxy. Juan Mascara, he plays for Alaska Airlines. Okay. It's Portland. Uh, Minnesota <laughs> United, the whole team are uh, yeah. Target employees. They are. Yeah. That is, like, that's like their thing. Ryan Gold plays for Marvel. He's got the ill communication. Uh, oh, here we go. Here's Avander. Uh, he plays for Alaska Airlines as well. And this is his, uh, some sort of a parallel. This is uh, nice. I just want to get some Austin FC guys. Let's see. Pitch prodigies, o uh, Obed Vargas, and then Cesar. Sporting Kansas Arjo. City. Keep he plays going. for some Orlando. More, some Health. more of these. The, the, the season starts at the end of the month, man. I'm getting pumped. Do you think, what year are these? Uh, probably last year. 2023. So maybe. Maybe they'll have some. Uh, Matko Miljevic. See our bad team. He plays for BMO. Mm -hmm. uh, Matai Akinbono. Uh, Boney, he plays for XTC Network. Uh, Marco Angulo of the Mercury Health Clinic. <laughs> Paxton Pomical plays for MavQ. It's appeared to be some sort of QAnon adjacent. Mm, yes, that's uh, what it is. Mikhail Ure. Yep. He's a rookie. I can't tell who he plays for. Uh, Philadelphia Thomas Union. Williams also plays for the health organization. And then uh, Efren, uh, Efren Alvarez. Oh, not a lot of, I wanted some Austin FC guys here, I bud. I see some Give me the Bear Day. You mean the Yeti team? team? Yeah, baby. Miguel Perez, uh -huh. he plays for Purina. Okay. <laughs> Steven uh, S. Suarada, mm -hmm. he plays for Red Bull. Mm. He he does. Georgios uh, Kutsias, can't tell. Okay. Uh, Charles Gill, Miles Robinson, mm. and then Sergio Ngoma. Uh, I'm not seeing... I want some Austin FC guys. Come on. What are we do? doing here? All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, this dude again. God damn it. Uh, Roman Berkey... Victor Wanyama, close. Close. Wrong sport, <laughs> wrong name. Kit Core from Sebastian Blanco. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of uh, Portland Timbers. BMO. Here's Jesus. The Poog. Oh, and of, the Poog. of course, the, a lot of Galaxy, too. Let's see. Am I going to be able to help you? We got something? We'll see. All right. Maybe. Maybe. Here we Lucho go. Lucho Acosta. Okay. Lucas Zellerian. Uh-huh. Uh... Joseph Martinez, he plays for XBTQ. Okay. Bank or something. Jack McGlynn, he's a bimbo. <laughs> uh, Brian Ojeda. Okay. And Chip Keller with the soccer ball parallel rookie card. Oh, what the that's, hell? That's, Go Yeti. That's the worst one to get. Yeah, but he's, it's a parallel, dude. He's got a... He... He had such a bad year last year. Oh no! Like, like I don't, I don't know if Kip Keller's still on our team. Austin FC went unbeaten in the six matches Keller appeared at, as a 2022 record. Right, right, right. As a 2022 rookie. Yeah. Yeah. How was his? Uh, how was his 2023 sophomore season? <laughs> he did bad. bad. Did he do as bad as Diego Rubio? Uh, or Martin Ojeda. Okay. What about Christian Benteke, numbered to 99? Hey! That's pretty cool. That's cool. What about Sebastian Ferreira? He's a pitch prodigy. Daniel Gazdag. He's a bimbo. And Kai <laughs> Wagner. He's also there you go. a bimbo. The, um, <laughs> the, the chat was just catching up to the Keller card, and uh, everyone was having a nice laugh about it. Oh, right. Yeah. Cool little parallel. <laughs> that was, I mean, that was a cool card. Yeah, I wish it, wrong guy. Yeah, right. Yeah. I that wish guy, it, I wish it would have been in Austin right now, and he's like, I'm gonna find Eric Bedore. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, I'm he's... gonna tell him what for. It's a round rock guy. And then he's gonna go. Yeah. <laughs> and we have ends with that team too. Yeah. He's gonna I, call up Jack, his buddy Jack. I real, I love Austin FC. Nick Lee was my guy, baby. But I think he's on our team. Jack right oils down the players. He does. He gets in there and he gets hands on with uh yeah with Stu. He, he's always like, hey, Stu, man, you want me to come over and work out your glutes? How you, you tensing up? I can help you out. How's your calf? I'm Jack. Yeah. Like, and y'all think that the hands. books we're talking about <laughs> where they do that is wrong? Well, Jeff Jeff has written one, so. Yeah, what's that? how's that coming along? I want to read I had it. to postpone it because Gavin and I had to film something for him. I was helping him out at the time that we were going to write porn. Because you, now, And then when you were filming, did you take a tumble? I, I didn't take a tumble. <laughs> 
<laughs> that's main podcast talk. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we okay. save that for the later. Important, the a, important thing is, is look, I, I'm not, no blood. Yeah. The, the well, image this was pulled from Instagram. Yeah. Was, oh. No more I blood. I have my first image ever removed from Instagram. Pretty crazy. Too graphic. Yep. Uh, here we go. Chris Paul. He's, uh, he should probably retire. Really? He should probably think about retiring. Is he, didn't he go to Golden State? Yeah, he plays for, well, he doesn't play for Golden State, but he's there. <laughs> he's, he's hurt right he, now. He's on a step, every time they he show Steph Curry, the only time you just see highlights and it's him so upset. Yeah. Well, he's he, having to fucking move mountains to get that team across the 500 finish line. Yep. Josh Giddy, global reach. We uh, like him. Mm. Right? <laughs> Isn't he the Timothy Chalamet looking guy? Yeah. He's the one that the police are not prosecuted. <laughs> yeah. They decided not to for they, they closed said, the investigation. They said they that's said, enough. Oh, he's fine, so we didn't yeah. do anything wrong. Oh, that's the Oklahoma City guy. Yeah. Oh. With the 16, 15 year old girl. The, with Livy Dunn. Yeah. Who was Kevin at the bar? Like, yeah. Dante yeah. DiVincenzo. Well, I'm not, I'm not part of this conversation. Baby uh, Gronk this. finished rizzing up Livy Dunn and then moved <laughs> on. And uh, here we are. And we will not be prosecuted. I don't know what y'all are talking about. Tyrese Maxey, I feel bad for him. Uh, Ty, uh, because he's really, really good, mm -hmm. and he should be really just soaring this year, but then fucking uh, Dudu and Embiid got hurt, and now they're dog shit, and they're yeah. making a bunch of desperation trades to try to cobble together a postseason. Is he done? This year? They say he might be back in uh might be back right around the time of the playoffs. I don't I wouldn't expect it. Yeah. Because even if he comes back, a guy that big who's been, he's he's gonna take him a while to get back into playing shape anyway. Yeah. And you don't want to be going through that in the playoffs. Yeah. So who knows? Tyler Harrow, green prism parallel. That is my most despised player in the NBA. Interesting thing about Tyler Harrow. Oh. Uh Andrew has decided he's got the most punchable face in the NBA. hundred percent. Yeah. Totally agree. Yeah. Uh interesting thing about Tyler Harrow? He played the Celtics uh, just yesterday. Yeah. Uh, got his dick pushed in. Celtics beat the shit out of them. Fuck him. Celtics won. That's all. That's the interesting thing. Did fact. he uppercut Porzingis' are... dick or what? No, that's Bam yeah. Adebayo. Oh, okay. He would give him the old... Who's the one that I hate on... Uh, you don't Gold... like Duncan Robinson. Golden State. Oh, in Golden State? Who I want to punch him in the stupid face. You don't like Clay Thompson. I don't like Clay Thompson. That's oh, a punchable yeah. face. Yeah. We talk Tony Bates, rookie. We talking about cool Ooh. players. Talk about Draymond. Hell Buffalo. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Talk about someone's doing the punching. <laughs> that's a base Buffalo. By the way, I haven't looked at... Look at... How serious. <laughs> He's like, get a card. <laughs> Dude, I'm a Bucks guy. I'm I'm with the Bucks you're with, now. You're Pat Bell. I'm, Bev, I'm, Bucks I'm all, all in on Pat Bev. Let's go. Zach wow. Levine. Here's a silver DeMar DeRozan. Oh. I can't fucking believe he still plays for the Bulls. Mm -hmm. Just wasting a career. Yep. Devin Booker, silver cracked ice That's parallel. That's a cool card. Um, Grant Williams, <laughs> wrong team. Wow. He's two teams. That's two teams ago. Wow. He plays for Charlotte as of last week. Woof. I feel bad for Grant. He uh, he didn't work out in Dallas, and it's apparently uh, they so they trade him at the trade deadline. Mm -hmm. and his all accounts are that uh, he wasn't a good fit culturally. Really? Yeah. The the rub on Grant Williams is that he talks too much and he's annoying. Mm. But he, everybody on the Celtics kind of loved him and like a little brother kind of. Yeah. Thing. But he doesn't have that on a new team, so you know. That's tough. Jalen Green. Tough. Steve Nash. Yeah. yeah. I wish his body hadn't broken down. He was so much fun to watch. Great passer. Oh, Malachi Branham base. That's not what I'm saying. Oh, for what I'm saying. Say oh, for is the prism instant impact. Victor Wimbledon. Oh, Wimbledon. Cool. Dunk on them, That's, baby. These are usually uglier. It's not so ugly. That's a cool year. card. This is technically a prism, and it's a. So we should send that one off too. Maybe. Mm. Yeah. Fuck it. Why not? Why not? Fuck it. You check our eBay account, and as soon as we get it open, it's only money. Uh, Spencer <laughs> Dinwiddie. Uh, here's a Scoot Henderson. Uh, jury's still out. I thought it's an emergency. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Help. It's a bit of an emergency on his <laughs> shooting efficiency. Uh, DeAndre Jordan cracked ice. What? We didn't do values. I did. I just did the uh, only that one. That one yeah. card. It was the only, was the only one worth worth mentioning. Oh. Uh, Kobe Bufkin. He's got the coolest little hair. Uh, like did you go to UT? Knots. Oh. No, he's just he's just letting everyone know it's he's calling the play. Oh, he's rocking on. Yeah, he's not. He's he's putting the horns up, but it's not for UT. If he did. Okay. All right. Gracie says never mind. It is. Our, our resident UT <laughs> said yes. <laughs> Uh, okay, well, that was fun. When we go through these cards, uh, people don't know, Mike Pirtle's not here today, but when... Uh, oh, I was waiting for Mike to say if it wasn't. Yeah, uh, Mike's not here today, and uh, every time there's a UT player, any sport that we open a card for, we can't see him, but I know he's back there going, 
Just yeah, every yeah, time. Yeah. I'll see a little hand come up. Yeah. <laughs> He's always just putting them up. Next thing, uh, Emily, I went to the store today and I got a little present for you. <gasps> for me, because it was my birthday this weekend? Got you. Oh! Uh, oh! Disney Cutie Cuff. Oh, Cutie Cuff. Now, who is it we're looking for? I it's want, the cat. I want Marie. You want Marie? There she is. Yeah, that one. Them. Oh, that's going to be my hand someday. Mm -hmm. Oh, I hope so. It is. It's the. <gasps> that's a good one, too. It's not her. What is it? Is it Nemo? Who is it? I saw, I saw, oh, oh, it's it's, 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 Tigger. The, it's not Tigger. Oh no, it's not Tigger. It's, it's Raja. Raja from yeah. Jasmine. That's right. That's cute. Yeah. They can hang out with the big the little thing. Big Hero Six or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty cool. You look powerful. Well, you didn't get it this time, but maybe next week. Better what look was next it time. That also, was... I got you a special. Ah! Disney creepy cuffs. They're oh, villains. Oh, creepy cuffs. Yeah, you get Ursula. Who else would it's be It's for on evil there? little kids. <laughs> That's what you or have evil adult like, women. I want to be a super villain when I grow up. Okay, who do you think it is? Uh, this one. <gasps> oh, it's Cruella de Vil. Oh, wow, that's a... That's a good wait, 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 wait. Who else can we get? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You're right, you're right, you're right. Sorry. I want to see who it could be. All right, here's who we can who we can pull in future. Tracy wants to know so bad. Yeah. Cruella, Ursula, uh, Ed, Shere Khan, Ed. <laughs> Evil like Queen, mm -hmm. Scar. Yep, Hades. Hades, Woods is Maleficent, cool. and then that's it. Yep. Those are the bad guys. I like here. Ed. Yeah, Ed would be pretty He good. was like the dumb one of the hyenas, so he's fun. Well, you look powerful. Yeah. It's pretty cool. I've got a cutie and a cruelly. Whoa. A cutie and a cruelly. <laughs> Gracie wants these. Why um, think I think this was her jacket. She had a yellow jacket when she was point, like going yeah. crazy. Not the one that had like the long like tails on it. I think this was her, this looks like her driving face too. It was like, ah. Oh, yeah. When she's behind the wheel. Yeah, she's got like a cat killed his dogs. Uh... Let's look at some Alan and Ginter. We always loved open those. Love them. Emily loves Alan. They're Alan only and our favorite cards, and they'd become the best cards ever if they only featured someone who had started a <laughs> oh, major God. production company. And, and this guy again. Who we got? My hero. Uh, oh no. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Jordan Groshans rookie. How is Blake there not? Snell, hey, Blake Snell still still hasn't signed with a team. Two time is that true? Cy Young Award winner. Still Blake Snell has not. Pitchers and catchers reported. He has not signed a contract. I didn't realize he, oh my God. Crazy. He uh, wants like a 10 year deal. I think that's why. Evan Longoria, uh, Ev relic card. Evan Longoria with the Diamondbacks, huh? Apparently. Weird. Uh, here we have uh, Galapagos Islands. Ooh. That's cool, they're in Ecuador. No, my Falcon. Oh, if only you had cutie cuffs on your. We can't, we have filmable Falcons. Yeah, yeah well, they're not, it's not Friday at whatever time they go on sale, so I can't have a Falcon yet. 10 a.m. Central. So until then, until 10 a.m. Central on Friday, I have to use my cutie cuffs on my collar. Falcon, attack the cutie cuffs. <laughs> we got a, we got a, Eric, if I were to say we have the prince of baseball, who would you say? I'm prince thinking? Fielder? No, I'm talking about Ichiro. Oh. The other one, other one name baseball player. Oh, That's the it. prince of, yeah, prince. oh. Like prince? No, I, I get that. Yeah. When you said prince, I thought maybe it was the guy named Prince. Right, like Prince Fielder. No, that was really good. That Thank was you. really good. Appreciate that. I can see the confusion there, too. Mm -hmm. uh, what is that? Uh, Cabrian Hayes, uh, Jay Balvin, this was Justin Verlander. This was not a specific game or event of or year. Of course not. Don Staley <laughs> or player. Or, yeah, uh, or anything. Uh, Kenny Lofton. I Kenny Lofton with the Rangers, huh? Yeah. And then uh, Greg Maddox with the Cubs. Why I can't that? I can't escape that now. I don't know why. I don't know why that's like what? I don't I don't understand. Maybe I missed it, but I, and I know it's been going on for a while. But why are we Eric, excited about this? I, the, the, in in no world would I be like Greg Maddox, the Chicago Cub, Hall like, of I Fame baseball player. Would never. I just don't associate him with the Cubs at the Braves. One hundred percent. He played. He was on this pitching staff of the Braves mm -hmm. when they had three Hall of Famers at the same time. It was him, Tom Glavin, and John Smoltz. Yep. And they were just like the baddest pitching group of oh, just, all time. In the and then he like, left and went to the Cubs and had a lot of success. He did. Cubs. He had he a lot of success. Like, I would just never. Yeah. I would just never think of him as a Chicago. It just doesn't. Click with me. He, had, Green. he played 744 games. Yeah. <laughs> it's a lot of games. Grayson Rodriguez. I just don't know why it doesn't, I don't connect those dots in my head. Dang. He pitched 5,008 and one third games. Innings. Innings. <laughs> <laughs>
the the eight and one thirds yeah. threw me off. Hey, Dale Murphy. He struck out 3,371 yep. people. Yeah. No, hey, one of those people, not Tony Gwynn. That's true. Never struck out. He never struck him out. Never struck out. Uh, here's the 10,000th loot we got. <laughs> yeah! And then Zach Granke. Oh. oh, man. I think he's done. I think he retired. I think really? He officially retired, yeah. Sad. Is there a major league uh, baseball player who like would be known uh -huh. uh, who has never been struck out? No. No, everyone strikes out. Everybody strikes out. Yeah. And sway uh, yeah, That's right. Jefferson White. Tony Gwynn just that? does it so little, you know. I have no idea. That's a great question. Did he found a... He's an actor. He, uh, actor. he was in Yellowstone. Oh. Uh, there you go. Crazy loves that show. He <laughs> Javier Baez. Uh, what? She's a big Yellowstone She loves Yellowstone. She's like, oh, Costner? Yeah. I don't know what I just got and what we're about to show, what okay. I'm about to show you guys, but it's going to be I'm excited. Different. That's cool. What we got? Uh, we got Shane Bieber. Okay. Mini. We got an Enjoying a Pina Colada Fun and Something. Nice. Hey. To complete the collection. So that's actually pretty good. Nice. I'm trying to fill those out. I, I and did then that. we got, <laughs> okay, <laughs> this is so stupid. We got a Benny Wasserman dressed up as what? What? Albert what is this? Einstein Who is that? Card. He's an actor. So we got a relic card from Benny Wasserman, the actor. This is a genuine Topps Allen and Ginter relic card that features memorabilia from Benny Wasserman. I guess he is famous for acting as uh, Albert Einstein. Is what? he wearing like a Detroit jersey? Or is that just an old dude who looks like Albert Einstein? <laughs> no, and this is not I an think Albert Einstein thing at all. Actor. What is who is he? I'm gonna look him up. He's an actor. Okay. I think Jeff maybe just assumed that he plays Albert Einstein. No. He looks like Albert okay. Einstein. So yeah, so he just guessed. Now, do you think I, I could get some stuff from your closet and give to Alan and Ginter for relics? Yeah, we'll do You that. know? We've got yeah. we could do like the the jersey that you hit all the baseballs in. So many baseballs. He's he's gloved up with a bat. His too. name is Benny Wasserman. Yeah. Yeah, actor. Actor. TV the movie, Angels with Angles. What? I don't. None of these are. Jeff, this you should. This is why Jeff, Jeff you should, needs a card. <laughs> Jeff, you God should, damn it. Leave it to Beaver. We. He was in the Leave It to Beaver movie. Not Albert the Einstein. I'm not joking. He played Albert Einstein in. Jeff, in like everything, you are right. Oh my that's, God. That's crazy. How did you do that? He's the and we fucking got it. <laughs> what do you mean, how did I do it? Look at him. I went, oh, we got an Albert Einstein relic. Who the fuck is Wasserman? That, wild. All Incredible. Right. I love uh, it. Th that's going in the collection. 1994 Upper Deck Baseball. I think I bought these in Michigan at a yard sale. Nice. Uh, let's see what we got here. Uh, Luis Gonzalez. That's fucking That's nice. Cool yeah. That was a cool card. Oh, there's a good one. Uh, Ken Caminetti. Yeah, Cami with the Astros. Ooh, Ooh that's cards. a sup. That that's a, my that is a sup. That's a great uh, San Diego Padre, Ken Caminetti. Jeff Juden. I guess it's going uh, pussy sleigh. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Vince Coleman, looking like he's hobbling, but yeah. he's yeah. a really fast dude. Uh, <laughs> that's you after you step your toe on our bed frame. <laughs> Randy Johnson, it looks like he's saying, huh? What? Yeah, huh? what year are these from? 94. Wow. Uh, this is... Who is your Falcon? Sean Barry. Oh, he's hidden. He's, he's right here. He's keeping me safe. I just, from my angle, I couldn't see. <sighs> Sorry. Real Cormer. I'm waiting for it to not be him. protected. Uh, <laughs> ooh. <laughs> he's Raja. David Raja. Justin. Oh. That's the old... brave great. That's, uh, all right. Uh, Armando Reynoso. I haven't thought about him in a long time. Uh, here we have... Uh, Armando Reynoso again. We got two of them. What the fuck? <laughs> How'd they do that? I don't know. That was pretty cool. Nice of them. Eric Anthony. Mm -hmm. That's like a diamond parallel. Look at that. Ooh. That's kind of cool. That's worth so much money, dude. And then Jason Giambi, top prospect oh, nice. rookie. <laughs> we got a Jason Giambi rookie. Who's That's that? cute. Let's Is sleep cool? that. That's pretty crazy. Uh, he was a good player. Yeah. I, I, I would say that he, he had some success with the A's and then he went to the uh, New York. Yankees, uh huh. Right? Yeah, he, he went to the Yankees, Yankees and was. Uh, did not he, have success. He, had, he hit the ball very hard. What season was like Moneyball? Like, Shh. is he from that? It's a uh, I mean, round, a little bit early for that. No, no, I, Moneyball's after this because they got rid of Giambi. Yeah. And then like, that's like the big thing. Of, Giambi's like, I think in that. Wow. No, it they got- right after they got- It was, yeah. it was right after. Yeah. Cool. So right around Moneyball. Yeah. Uh, here's some of these uh, 91 tops. These are just like the ones uh, we got the box for. Yeah. Uh, so let's see what we got. We got Gary Wayne. 
Gary Wayne Gary. Uh, <laughs> he was that priest in Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. Oh, okay. Uh, he's the one that kept them under, the actor underground. The was? Or the, that basically? No, that was the character's name was Gary, Gary Wayne Gary. Gary. The actor was John Hamm. That's Brian right. Downing, Ken Caminetti. Yeah, <laughs> Cammy again. Luis Salazar. Oh. Scott Radinsky. Mm. Rick Dempsey, Dan Plezak, Jack Savage, nice. Denny Martinez. <laughs> this is going into some kind of a collection. <laughs> Bob Melvin. Hey. He's just having a think. That is uh, a think. Former, a former Padres manager, now Giants manager, Bob Melvin. He's having a thought. He's he's thinking about Let's it. See. Pat Combs. He's thinking about how he got himself into this. Jimmy mess. Key. Oh, so close to being the right one, but it's his predecessor, Ramon Martinez. Oh. <laughs> uh, Bob Walk. And Kevin Elster. Mm -hmm. Cool. Now we're going to open up uh, a pack of Goodwin Champions and then this pack of Topps Chrome Baseball. And then we're we going to get a, into our big thing. this so, heritage box. What is a little the, bit of that. And then oh, we're going to oh, open we, so, let the so we had a poll. The big thing. Okay. Uh, we had a poll and it's closed and we did it. So I know who the winner is, but um, we can wait to get to it. All right, we'll wait till we get to it. Have yeah. you ever seen that movie Drop Dead Gorgeous? Yeah. I know, know, who know, I know who the winner is. I know who the winner is. <laughs> You, what a what a your, what a minor with your, thing. That's so funny. But that's a, you with know, your that overall is a, stuck in the truck. Uh huh. What's that dude's name? Will Sasso. Will Sasso. You know we tried to hire him for Achievement Hunter for something. Really? I'll tell you a story real quick. So uh, while we're up in these, Vita Blue, uh, Ramon Lorano, uh, nice. Alex Rodriguez, A Rod, and then Maury Willis. Okay. So <laughs> we tried to hire him back in the day because he did he had this vine of him singing in the shower. Yeah. The Michael. Uh, yeah. The, Michael. Michael. And that was in. A thousand achievement hunter videos yeah. of us singing and making fun of that. So when we did the very first uh, Let's Play Live in LA, which was at the Grauman Theater, yeah, I don't know if it's called that still. I don't but know. It's a Chinese theater. L yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. It's where they do the Academy Awards. We mm -hmm. did a live show where they do the Academy Awards. And right? out front. And we tried to hire him to come out and just sing that yeah. as an interstitial for five minutes. And we're like, we contacted his agent. We tried to contact him. I think he followed one of us for a little bit, so we tried to message him directly and just never got a response. And we were offering some money, oh, too. Oh, bummer. And he just had to come out and go, like, eh, and then do, like, 30 seconds of yeah. him doing singing that song and then walk off, and he would we would have paid him. I mean, probably not big money for him. Uh-huh. Big money for us. Damn. And he was like so not interested in your, like won't return the calls. Damn. Like, I don't know, fuck with you. He does a great Jesse the Body Ventura impression. Yeah. He's a <laughs> funny really dude. Yeah. He's also great in Happy Gilmore. Yeah. He's one of the movers. Uh, Fred Couples. Woof. That's my guy right there. <laughs> That's that waste management. That's, boy, <laughs> That's Fred Couples, huh? Maybe Fred Couple less, man. I don't know. <laughs> wow. Uh, Anthony Richardson. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Uh, here's a Grady Dick Young Guns. Hey! That's, cool. That's our boy. I didn't know they did Young Guns for other sports. That's, That's our, a hockey thing. That's, That's that baby dick. There. Okay, all right. Baby dick. Well, there you go. Right. Gigi Jackson. He's getting a lot of playing time out. for the Hell fucking yeah. uh, Grizzlies right now because everybody's hurt. Yeah. And then uh, Bryce Young. Rough season, Woo! Bryce. Rough, rough season. All right. Dick had a very impressive first season at Kansas. As he set a school record for made three-pointers by a freshman with 83. He went four for five from beyond the arc while scoring 20 points in the Jayhawks' whatever home win over the Indiana Hoosiers. Yep. I was watching boy. a lot of uh, Kobe highlights recently. Uh -huh. like they did, you know, the, the statues and everything and just sort of got fed a bunch of them. That guy was such a fan of taking the long two. Like, he just uh, – what take one, one more step, step back. back. Yeah. What the fuck? Kobe, Kobe that was, care. but that was the Kobe NBA at that time. Like 2007 NBA is the long two. I don't buy this. This particular me neither. I don't fucking get it. I don't Bob buy Savage. it. Yeah. Uh, so I was surprised to see that it was the number one selling uh, card box mm -hmm. across all sports. But I bought. We I had I had, I had uh, Gracie get him. But I haven't had a chance to look at what the chase cards are. So oh, I really okay. don't know what we should even be looking for in this. Do you think it's because they're more available, so they're most selling? Uh, they're, they're cheaper, but I think also people really love them. Like, they're beautiful. very beloved. People love baseball yeah, and baseball true. cards. Well, baseball's so much bigger. And, than uh, you know, cards. pitchers and catchers reported. Ooh. So there you go. That is that so this is fucking cool. <laughs> All right. It's Claude Osteen, so I'm okay. not familiar with Claude Osteen, apparently a pitcher for the Houston Astros. But one, this is uh, probably a buyback. So what they will do in some of these products is they'll go and they'll collect old, actual old baseball cards. Like uh -huh. this is uh, 1973. Wow. This is a legitimate 1973 card. So they got it. You can see it's miscut. Mm -hmm. They collect them in good shape, and then they put the stamp on it and then resend them out. So this was just like a box topper. But this is actually wow. from 1973 that they went and collected 
brought it back, stamped it, and put it in a product. That's neat. If yeah. anyone from Tops wants some old shit, we've got a bunch hanging around. <laughs> you know? Put this in the sack pack? We, uh, we'll sell you some. How many of these are we getting into? We'll get into like, I don't know, five minutes worth. Okay. And then we'll switch over to whatever the last thing is. Oh, man. However long that takes. Yep. I, <laughs> I'm always paying more attention to time. Uh, I minutes. get it. I appreciate uh, all you. right, let's see what we got here. Victor Robles, uh, Anthony Rendon, uh, Roughnet Odor, Rugnet. Uh, Gregory Santos. You know why they did this one, this card? Why? Because this is bringing back the 1974 Tops design, so they're showing you what an oh, original there you one go. looks Oh, that's like. pretty that's cool. That's fucking brilliant. That's and that's very smart of you. That's really yeah, cool. I fucking read the box, y'all. Uh, Boom! Special. Roger Maris, Aaron Judge. That's <laughs> cool. Keep it to the podcast. <laughs> Pablo Lopez. <laughs> John Gomez. Really J.D. <laughs> Martinez. And then Taylor Motter. All right, let's see... A little bit more of these bad boys. I'm so excited for baseball getting started right now, and it's going to be... Kyle Gibson? Oh, dude, speaking Oof, of... Man, it's going to be crazy. Cal Stevenson rookie. Uh, Jose Hernandez rookie. Padres, Dominique right? Fletcher. Look fine. Sam Bachman. We Dylan Dodd. A bunch of... Uh, Blake Perkins. Jeez, they're all fucking rude. Didn't uh, sign a Castillo. Shohei Otani for a lifetime contract yeah. and defer all the payments to 2030. <laughs> I don't worry about collecting any money. Everybody associated with years. the team will be dead by the time we have to yep. pay that bill. Uh, the 2030 Dodgers, like that decade, I'm really looking forward to when they have no money. It's going to be so awesome. Here's Just something. Get step on them. Here's something I'm kind of excited about. Burn Dog, uh -huh. uh, Trucks Bernie, yep. Vince Velasquez was telling me that out of all Shintaro uh, Fujinami, out of all the uh, sports, he thinks baseball is the one he could get into the most. Yeah, he was talking he about that, yeah. He wants to get yeah. into baseball this year. He's going to come over on opening day. He wants to be a Tigers fan. Oh, cool. And so if you want to come over, we're going to watch the Tigers on oh, opening day. I'll watch fuck the around. Tigers, hell yeah. We're I would go love... Go to the Tigers game. Yeah. Bernie's one of those dudes. Burn Dog's one of those dudes when he gets into something, he gets into it. Yeah. Like, if you ever talk to him about metal, he'll... You, he could go for oh, like yeah. 10 hours, and that's nothing compared to what he knows about painting. So him getting into baseball, I think he'll love it because... It appeals to those kind of people. He was the bartender at figures. at Mohawk when a bunch Lucas, of wrestling shows were happening. Mason, there. yeah. We found out like we'd crossed paths there before, and he was like super into it. Oh, and this cool. is cool, Miguel. Uh, uh, this Miggy. is Miggy card, Miguel Cabrera, April twenty third, twenty twenty two is three thousandth hit. I, think it's neat. I don't. I don't feel one way or another about the Tigers in, in particular. Miller. I do hope they turn Mike it around. Sable. I that do is too. a that's that's Robin a Solano. pretty storied franchise that deserves more than they're getting. And, well, uh, it's it's really a bummer. And I also, struggle. I'm just I've been rolling with the White Sox for a very very long time, and you're about, about to we're jump all off pretty that train. fucking yeah. worn out by yeah. it. You know, it's just it's it's just like. Who's your favorite team? The kick me in the dick team. <laughs> I just go, I line up every year for about eight months, and they just kick me in the dick over and over again. Then I get four months to ice my balls, and then I go back and do it yeah, again. Yeah, I was a, like to be a White Sox fan. Yeah, man, I'm a Padres fan, and then I was a Chargers fan. It was year thing. year you know, round. You, your dick balls know, yeah. yeah. I was a Detroit fan. They don't even kick you in get the dick minute. anymore because they just feel bad. Exactly. <laughs> They're just like, hey, you guys, you, 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 you just got it, fine. you got it. It's no, not about no. winning; it's about having fun. The name yeah. of the game is fun. Yep. Here's uh, Hank Aaron, the Hammer. Nice. Jared Schuster, Jose Caballero, uh, Trice Terang. I don't know any of these rookies. And then Sean Manea. All right. Uh, I think we're probably ready. Let's do one more of these packs. <laughs> and then we're probably ready to get into what is going to be the final big think, pull. Have you seen the Detroit Tigers uh, uh, batting practice hat? I stop? No. Mm -mm. It's just got the... It's. They got the Bolton. cat. It's got the cat on it and stuff. The old cat or the yeah, no? They're they're spring training cat. I'm sorry. Oh. It's got no. It's just the regular. He's like, Arr. he's like. There's the old design of the cat. That I wish they would that. bring that back. Jeff, I got Jeff a shirt of the that. The crazy yeah. crack. The, the fucking yeah. cracked out cat. Yeah, yeah. Crack he's cat. awesome. A lot of Justin Verlander today. Yeah. Okay. What's it gonna be, Eric? Are we gonna open up this very expensive now, single card or this not so expensive? Now, video game? here's what I'll say. I we don't have to leave it totally up to the chat. The chat, shockingly, voted for the video game. Hell yeah. 79% uh, or whatever. I think, with that information, it was just Emily's birthday, so she should choose. Thank you for this opportunity to mm -hmm. listen to the people. And <gasps> as the people's princess, I will only listen to my people, and we will go for whatever they vote All right. for. Wow. Here's what we're not opening today. We're going to open up a $75, yep. $80, whatever. It's going to be Duck Hunt. This is one card that uh -huh. I think we paid about 300 bucks for this. <laughs> nice. Somebody thought it was assigned to basketball. <laughs> Just read it wrong. Well, then you should but. tune in for not next week because we're not going to be yeah. here, but the week after, and we'll I open that. I know it's in that fucking box now that I don't open it. 
Man. <laughs> maybe you order, maybe I gotta stop letting the other people involved. I, I really wanna open that fucking box. Why don't you open that box and we just buy another one? Nah, what? <laughs> I used See? all of our budget on that box. Yeah, no kidding. It's fine. We can girl math this and this figure it out. This is not how this works. All right, this is 46 of 50. <laughs> Let's see what highly collectible and hopefully rare... Gyromite! NES video game we've got. Ooh, it comes with a... Fisher can't wait. He's stoked. Ooh. Oh, that's bad. I was oh, like, it came in the card as the Metal of Honor card. How did it come in the Metal of Honor card? Good. This is Hit Parade. And this is... The video game... Mega Man! Mega Man! <laughs> that's pretty cool. Yeah, I don't... Whoa, that's awesome. Yay. I didn't know we were capable. I didn't know we were capable of stuff like that. That was pretty cool. Oh, cool. An original Mega Man. Does it say what it's graded at or anything? I don't it's think it's sealed. graded. It's okay. just sealed so, and authentic. Do you want me to like go home and get this for you? Or yeah, what? you could just get this for me. I mean, I just <laughs> we go to any yard sale and get it. <laughs> yeah. I think it's they're harder to get now, apparently. So there you go, Mega Man. Well, it's like it's like the the seal is nice, like the sticker's good. It's in great uh -huh. shape. We should yeah. don't, don't we have graded? some old Xbox games we're gonna get graded? No. Uh, I have something I'm supposed to send to Andrew. That, that he was interested in getting him. graded. Maybe we'll get this graded and see what that's about. All right, let's open this up. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, I just want to know. We're doing both, baby. As the people's princess, we just want everybody to enjoy. Yeah. Want everyone to be happy. I just want to see what my fuck up got us. Uh-huh. Like, what? what's the rule? How much was it? $350? $350. So I want to see what this $350 yep. fuck up got us. Boom. What do you want it to be? Anything worth three hundred. What do you guess? Uh, like uh, LeBron Auto. <laughs> oh, okay. Tatum okay. rookie. Okay. I, I mean, mean, it's gonna be that kind of thing. Okay. You think so? Okay. Yeah. No, but yeah, let's see. Maybe it's a maybe it's a, Here it comes. Here it comes. Come here, back. Set it up. Show everyone. It is a shade on sharp PSA ten rookie optics autograph. <laughs> That's not a poop. That's a really good card. I don't think it's a three hundred fifty dollars card. No, but maybe. Let's Who is that? Tell Shade on Sharp. It. He's good. He plays for the Trailblazers. He was a rookie last year. This is, I believe, his second or third year. He just got, I want to say, a season-ending injury like a week ago, mm. or at least he's out for a little bit. But he's real good. Uh, this is one of the like if you're gonna get a rookie card of a, a top prospect like this, this would be a good one to get. Optic is highly sought after, mm. probably behind Prism these days. It probably goes Prism Optic. Really? Yeah, over like Select and Mosaic and those. And uh, it's uh, I wish it was on card. Um, it's not a three hundred fifty dollar card, I don't think. But oh shit, it's numbered to forty nine. It oh, might be. It might be. <laughs> that might yeah. be. That might be a decent card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see real fast. ROA SSP. ROA wow. SSP. Not bad. Uh, Maybe we should put that on our... It's a good little get. That's not a bad card. ROA. Are you looking at it right now? Yeah, what? why not? Behind the scenes. What's that? that? 150? Mm-hmm. It sold... Well, that one sold for 316. Oh, hell uh, yeah. <laughs> that was uh, numbered to... Five. Oh, it was a golden number to ten. A uh, number to eight. Uh, you know. This uh, is an M. You know, you win some, you lose some. <laughs> to be determined on this one, though. What if Sh if Shadon Sharp makes the All Star game yeah. once in his career? Yeah. This is you got our money's worth. Okay. Well, that's if very the exciting. Portland Trailblazers win a title, forget about it. I'll, All right, I'll hold my breath for that one, bud. Now need. that they don't have Damian Lillard. Yeah, now, nah, oh, finally. Get, die, rid, like. get rid of the dead they've weight. They've got Shade on Sharp. <laughs> they've got well, Stude they, Henderson. Well, they don't have Shade on Sharp. They've He's got out. Jeremy Grant. <laughs> they've He's got Malcolm injury. Brogdon. They've got a uh. very injured Robert Williams. Oh, uh, he's from, uh, he's Boston. always injured. I know. Oh, the, baby. Well, thank you so much for watching. Um, and if you're watching this, you can sign up to become a first member, guys. Thank you so much for your support. We can't do it without you. And, and this Friday at 10 a.m. Central, yeah, Falcon Collection, store.roosterteeth.com. Release the Falcon on someone. Um, I don't know how many Falcons we have, but we also have a shirt, a hat, a bumper sticker. We got it all. Store.roosterteeth.com. Uh, fuck Facepod, facepod.com slash first to sign up and support us. Thank you so much. Release the Falcon. I love that. It's kind of like releasing the Kraken, but this one's real. Okay, here he comes. Ready? Yeah! Big Look at him go.